It being the nicest model, you get a lot more chrome trimming and everything around it. You get the chrome trimming around the door handles as well as the chrome trimming down here uh, and uh, around the windows as well. Very nice design. The, the whole redesign of the Impala, we've had a lot of great feedback from it. Uh, drives nice, rides nice, feels nice on the inside. Uh, gets pretty good gas mileage and uh, it's, uh, a lot of nice features on the inside, all of which I will gladly show you now. As you can see, it does have power windows, power mirrors, power locks right there. You get a couple settings for your seats right there as well. Coming on the inside here, you'll notice it has uh, some controls for the cruise control right there, as well as controls for hands-free calling and uh, for the driver information center, which is located right there. If you press these arrow buttons, you get a little drop-down menu there. You could uh, see you know, audio settings, phone settings, navigation, whatnot, what have you. If you look at the center here with the uh, the stereo, it's, it is all touch screen. You got the navigation, uh, phone, Pandora, radio. You got a weather, on star buttons right there. Uh, if you press this little button down here, the screen slides up. You have a little storage compartment that can be locked, obviously, when the car is off, and it also has a USB input in, in there as well. You got your climate control right here for both sides of the vehicle. You got OnStar right up here above the mirror along with uh, sunroof controls. Um, yes, it does have a sunroof. Uh, you have some uh, garage door opening controls right there. Compartments all over the place. You got heated seats front and back. Um, and I mean front and, uh, and bottom I should say. You open up this in here and you'll notice it has SD, SD sorry, uh, card slot as well as a couple USB slots and the auxiliary input. The seats in here are nice black leather with some brown trimming. A lot of room in the back for uh, any passengers you might have uh, more more than two that might need to overfill into the back. That's uh, pretty much what I wanted to show you. Um, again, this is an Apollo LTC, and uh, again, my name is Mike Mitchell, and we're here at Apple Chevrolet in Tilly Park. Thanks so much for watching the video, and have a